I got into a fucked up situation. I'm traveling and my luggage is lost. It never happened to me, although I've been traveling a lot and I have some pack. What will we talk about over this episode? We're gonna talk about how to pack, what to put where, what happens if your luggage gets lost, um, what to do next, and some hacks on the airplane and also around the airport. Let's start with packing. I always wanted to make a packing video because traveling almost half of the year. I think I found some hacks, my hacks, so this is what I'm gonna share this week. So let's get to it. I created the list like a way back that I always go through when there is a, a trip coming up. I know the length, like what luggage I'm gonna use now. I have a, a normal baggage and I will have a carry-on and my backpack. Since I have Tom's, I love Tom's, I've been bringing two Tom's shoes and uh, one or two Nike Rocheron, which is my favorite. And the full cap. Good thing that I visualize it and pack them out because there are so many things missing. Need a converter, check. I have my GoPro, I have the cable, but I need the tripod for it. Brand new chat. Just in case if I meet, you know, Casey Neistat or Will Smith. I have my MacBook, the charger, hard drive. I have the external hard drive, but I will make a full backup to another local hard drive. I have my US, two USB charger check. I have my e cigarettes, got my uh, business card. I have movies, my small external speaker, but what's missing is my beloved Bioplay HA, my AirPods and the iPad. All the electronics, check. Forbes, I still need to find books. Oh, very important for the airplane. So this thing is from a Kickstarter project. I love it because, uh, and my favorite is this one. So I can put this here and I can sleep this way basically solves my issue because I always like to sleep on the front so this, this thing is very useful definitely coming to a long haul trip I've got everything so now packing of course for packing I will have my mom's help that's the best packing done I love better I love to travel with the three-piece plan. This is my luggage, I have almost everything there. I have a change cloth and gym clothes here. And I have my backpack with all the electronics and devices. Oh, and one more thing which is cool. I chose this backpack just for this. I can take it like this. You will see in the airplane why it is crucial to have this at least two-piece plan on the airplane when you do a hack that I'm about to show later. might be lost the most typical travel hack that you need to do that you have a change of clothes and what you need in your carry-on shit happens when you have to put on your carry-on and it gets lost your baggage is lost I'm so sorry first you have to go to the lost and found and claim everything give all the descriptions and hopefully you didn't know what I did that you travel with a shitty airline never fly Air Berlin Air Berlin has the worst customer support. Other thing, don't fly connecting flies if you check in luggages in Berlin Tegel. That's the worst airport to handle luggages in Central Europe. 
make sure you have insurance you have a travel insurance and in in these cases you don't have to wait for the shitty airline customer service second thing is go and get the essentials basically they cover up to like two or three hundred euros and it will be good for you if you are not looking out to buy Gucci and Prada to get some shirts underwear uh, we are going to a beach area so I have a beach shorts and actually to a wedding so a nice trouser and the bottom-up shirt I had to make that myself dark because here is a secret at the airport you have a long haul connection connecting flight go to a business lounge how you ask wait there dress well behave nice and ask people going in if you can be there plus one maybe you have to ask a couple of people but it worked like a charm for me this is the airplane hack basically we have infinite number of here Baby. You saw the hack, so what you want to do is to book with an agent, with an airline that allows you to pick your seat before you actually make the purchase and reserve because it's not only the you know, extra leg room or the priority for less than a price than even like a premium economy don't even talk about business you can get the first row, the exit row and not in the center but on the side where you don't, don't have anything and that's just amazing I put my carry-on which is lost but I'm using cutters and uh, also my backpack you can put your leg on the top of them and almost lay down with all the pillows you get so it's way better than the premium economy. So some things to do before and on your flight. If it's a long haul, adjust to the time zones you are traveling to. Get a good meal before, but take the meal that fits the time zone of your destination. That's very important. Try to adjust your sleep as well if you can. I will get a good night's sleep, hopefully. That's it for today. Don't forget to hit subscribe and help me find the luggage. I've been doing this my whole life. I've been balling out my whole life. And I know it's time because I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. Ready to go. All of my friends have been telling me, bro, it's time that you blow. I know.